And developing right now at noon, the 4th of July holiday turning deadly here in South Florida. A man was killed while setting off fireworks in Pompano Beach. And local 10 News reporter Parker Branton joins us live from the scene with what went wrong. Parker. A Janice family members are identifying the victim as Tavares Hamilton. We're told that he is a young man that had a daughter along with that he was engaged, ready to be married. Just a tragic incident that unfolded here on the 4th of July, just outside of this home at 2930 Northwest 5th Street. We are told the 31 year old man was setting off fireworks outside. He put a PVC pipe partially in the ground and put a three inch mortar shell inside. He then lit the explosive and it detonated before he moved away from the device. Hamilton suffered massive shoulder, neck and head injuries and was brushed to Broward Health North, where we later are learning now that he died from those injuries. Now, we did speak with his brother this morning, who says this is just a sad situation. His family is still trying to wrap their minds around. It's just tragic. I mean, you know, with the family right now, it's, it's unexpected, you know, that this will happen through fireworks. Nobody doing good right now. We just got to try to pull ourselves together. And family members tell us that this is the 4th of July is a very big holiday for them. They tell us Hamilton was setting off those fireworks for the children and the family and the children in the neighborhood to enjoy. The family tells us they are planning a type of memorial service out here at 6 o'clock. We're live in Pompano Beach, Parker Branton, Local 10 News.